Right, next stop, how about the easiest job you'll ever do on a Ford Ranger? EGR blanking plate, stop the crap getting in your EGR. Um, 12mm spanner to do it, okay? Just a 12mm spanner, maybe a pry bar if we get stuck. Not pre loosened these nuts, and you can time me doing this, I reckon it's easily under a 5 minute job. Um, take the plate out of its thing. Uh, simple blank plates, it's a phase one ranger that I've got here um, with a mechanical fuel pump so it doesn't need a hole in the middle or anything like that and I am planning on removing the system when I get a chance all we're going to do unbolt these two 12mm nuts here that one, sorry, bolts, that one and that one side the plate in without fully removing the bolts it's going to go on the on the front rather than the back of the gasket that's in there you can just about see and then we're going to bolt it back up again. So, um, well, I'm just looking at it. We've just ticked over a minute into the video. And it would help if I put the spanner on the right way around. It's tight. Today's top tip, don't catch your ratchet spanner in the gap. Go. Or if you do have a pie bar handy. That's not going to pull out enough for us. So all we're going to do is... Blanking plate in and we were at two and a half minutes to do it. And it probably would have been a minute if I'd not screwed up with the um, getting the spanner stuck. Cool, okay. Lovely, well done guys. 